What's up, guys? Time to chew some backy. It's been hours and hours and hours and hours and hours. But <clears throat> I've been waiting for this all day because I went to the store earlier and I went to the Wally World, the Walmart, and I picked up a variety and I don't know much about chewing backy because I dip and I used to smoke a lot, but now I just do the Oh, Copenhagen this, Copenhagen that, maybe Grizzly Strait or something. But today, <clears throat> I went out and I spent some money. I got some loose leaf. And I've uh, been waiting to do these videos until I got a good camera. I just got a new camera, so here we are. I hope this camera's staying in focus. I might have to play with it a little bit. Um, First off, I got the old classic. This is the only thing I've ever had, and I haven't had this one. I got the Red Man Golden Blend. Yeah. Yeah, good old smokeless tobacco is addictive. America's best chew. Where was it? Who made it? Let's see, it's uh, redman.com. Pinkerton Tobacco Co. Owensboro, Kentucky. 65% uh, at least 65% domestic grown tobacco. I'm not chewing this today. I'll do that. I'll do a review on that. I've had some Red Man before that and some other weird plug stuff, but that was a lifetime ago. Man, I guess this is a classic. I don't know. I got the Beech Nut. Never had it, heard of it, but this is the original flavor saver receive resealable package. I can read. I promise. Beech Nut Original Chewing Tobacco, established in 1897. Is it the same, same recipe? Only allowed in the United States. Leaf content, domestic, no less than 56%. Foreign, no more than 44%. <coughs> Still not quite my favorite numbers, but who makes this? Let's see, this is a National Tobacco Company, Beech Nut. I got that. I'll probably do that next. Um, unsealed, open. I got them today. And then what we're doing today, and I'm excited about this because I heard good things. Uh, the Levi Garrett. Yes, sir. Loose leaf chewing back. Levi Garrett and Sons. And this is, uh, let's see, manufactured by American Snuff Co. So, like the Grizzly and and all that other stuff. This ought to be good. So this is 61% U.S., 39% imported. I think that's the most. See, this one's 61. Oh, no, Red Man, 65. Oh, Red Man, they got it. But let's crack this bad boy open. Are you ready? <laughs> I, haven't, I haven't had any nicotine in since before dinner, we had some Cornish game hens and uh, potatoes with celery. They had we put mandarin orange inside that little Cornish game hen with some rosemary thyme and onion powder. We didn't have onions, so I used a mandarin orange, and it was I just used a lot of onion powder there too to make up for it. But it was good. Let's crack this. I haven't done this in years, man. This is fantastic. All right, let's get a sniff. Yep, yeah, yep, yeah, raisins. Hmm. Yeah, do, what do they use? Grape juice? Apple juice? What are they using? Alright, let's let's check this out. Shut let me turn on this light. How about that? That might help out a bit. Yeah, alright. So nice uh some kids outside. Hey, dude. This is what it looks like. This is what I'm going to throw in my mouth. Camera's over there. Let me see if I can get it to focus. Yeah, alright. Let's go to the mouth. Drop a little bit. Alright. Hmm. Huh, it's just addictive. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah, I can get used to that. Mm-hmm. Mm. Uh-oh. Shit, I got a spit. Where's my bottle? I'm just fucking with my bottle. Fuck, what was I thinking? No bottle. I'm just kidding. <laughs> Go. Mm. It's really fucking sweet. Mm. I don't know how long we will keep this in. I hear oh, it's pretty sad. Mm. Well, I'll be. I'm gonna fill this mud jug up. Mm. Well, mm. what does it taste like? It smells like raisins, but. It's got a sting to it. It's like kind of tingles your tongue. It says, "Don't swallow me." Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So my camera's going out of focus. I don't know much about it. I just got it the other day. Leave a comment below if you know a good uh, app to use on the S9. Galaxy, whatever. I got that good. Well, I don't like it as much as dip. It's really sweet. A little uh, caramely molasses. You can mm. stick my nose in that bag now. That I got a bite in. It smells like ra raisins, man. It smells like mother freaking sun made raisins. Ain't nothing special. Levi Garrett. I, you know, I'm going to keep this in a little while. It's even sweeter than that Southern blend. I I was asking for some Red Seal. I was going to do a Red Seal review too, but Walmart didn't have any, like I said. I don't know if I'm looking forward to these other two bags, but I think I'm going to try and chew my way through this. We'll see. This stuff's supposed to last a minute. I might, I might have to, uh, hold on. Hold on, because I'm a tobacco enthusiast, and I need my nicotine. I've been holding off. I, I guess this doesn't really have the buzz that I was expecting. I don't want the whole face full, you know. I want to be able to talk to y'all. Anyhow, I'm going to do a double. Double, double review. I need some nicotine. So this here is uh, an open can. Uh, spoiler alert, it's really... Pretty good. I liked it. This is my first kind of snuff I ever had. I'm a new on the smokeless tobacco, but this is the first one I had. This is the W. E. Garrett and Sons Scotch Snuff Original. And uh, this stuff smells like a campfire, dude. Just like, smells like you rolled around in a campfire. But, let's give you a little. It's a little dark in my room. I'm trying to get some light on it. Let me try. Uh, let me try this. Hold on. Oh, I'd have to take the bulb out to do that. Never mind. My mom would kill me. 
I'm going to take a little bit of this snuff, clean my fingers as such, brush off the excess. Mm. Or you do it this way, watch. You can create yourself the little spoon. Like that. You like you can make a deep one if you want, if you're like a coke addict. But we're snuff. We're doing snuff. So we can do it like that. So what you do is you would take a pinch. I'm going to take a relatively big one because I want to get a buzz in this freaking... I just really, really need my nicotine. This chewing tobacco don't pack a buzz, so I don't see what the point is unless you want some serious gum rot. Yes, this stuff does cause gum disease or tooth loss if you don't brush your fucking teeth. And even then, it might even cause... Because it's like super, super sweet. Way sweeter than any dip, but... I guess it's got its purpose, you know. It lasts a long time. It's got a lot of flavor. Anyways, I want the nicotine. Then you just so you take your pinch and you just sprinkle it. Well, let's see. Yeah, you sprinkle it on it. Ooh, that's a lot. Ooh, that's a lot. I'm gonna do it for both. No, both. Boy, that's a lot. Oh, that's a lot. Yeah, it's a lot, but I'm committed. <coughs> There's still a little more on there. <coughs> that stuff is really potent. It's not really a burn, but it, like the powder, it's really dry. I don't know how. I don't know if, if it's supposed to be this dry. If I got expired stuff, because the smoke shop I got, I got this other stuff, and the other stuff was way expired. But packs a nicotine punch, mm. and it's just like, and it it's manly as. Fuck, this is like campfire in your face. You should like you got a campfire to brew it in your nose. Like, and if you do it properly and don't snort it like cocaine, mud jug one. Outlaw. <laughs> you guys be snorting it like coke, dude. Y'all done too many drugs. But hey, solid project product, mud jug one. Solid product. I, I I was happy to go back to dip it again once I saw the bottles were gone. Because I was like I got sisters and a girl, and they don't want to see a bucket full of spit. This turned into a plug, but it's a really solid product, man. I like it. Good. It's worth the money. You tend to get two for one. So, eat that, China. <laughs> uh, oh, speaking of China, Hillary's emails. You hear about that? Just, you know, just waiting on the word. That's all. Just waiting on the word, but whoo, where's my hanky? <laughs> yeah, anyways, this stuff is uh, campfire in the nose, and if you just lightly do it, see, I did a lot, and it hit the back of my throat. Oh, there's my hanky, I just washed it. It's got motor oil, it's covered in motor oil and brown snot, black paint. You don't even really need to chew on this stuff. What? Hmm. Hmm. Well. Review of Levi Jarrett. Let's see here. What I think of it. Once you get past the sweetness, like, it's so sweet at the beginning. Man, so sweet. I think they do that to get the spit rolling, like, because that's the pleasant part. I like that. That's what I like about it, too. It felt good to spit. I already spit a lot.
but no one wants to see that black spit in the big. You won't see it carrying a spit jug around. You can't see the spit. I walk at a Best Buy with this motherfucker. Go buy me some nasal snuff with this motherfucker. Man, that shit hit back my throat. I'm like, Bleh. it burns kind of like right here. Your nicotine burn, you know? But, um, Levi Garrett tastes like a dark tobacco. Sweet as fuck. Kind of getting stuck in my teeth. I want to spit it out because it's on the side that I got my root canal. I ain't got it capped yet. Move it. Over on the side where I got the crown. Makes more sense that way. I gotta brush his teeth now. Yeah, kind of get stuck in your teeth. You move around a lot easier, but you get a lot of floaters. I think that's the nature of loose leaf. It's mellowing out, you know. Pretty good flavor. Dark, tingly, burning, smoky, sweet still. Sweet, sweet, sweet. There goes that focus again. I'm sorry about the focus. I'm trying to find a new app. Like I said, if you know a really good app for Samsung app, I'm looking, Googling, and trying a few others. I might be using like open camera or if I can get cinema 4K for cheap. I can't afford it right now. I just bought a new phone. But, hmm. Chewing tobacco. Overall. I'm excited to see what these other two flavors taste like. The originals. I think I'm going to do the beech nut next. I hear it's got an interesting, unique flavor. I'll let you know what I think. I think from kind of remembering that the Levi Garrett sort of reminds me of the Red Man. But, mmm. A lot of spit. I'm going to fill this mud jug up in a freaking hour. I'll bet you this have flavor this whole hour. This is a minute, 15 minutes, 17 minutes. Mm. I got a good buzz, though. Good nicotine buzz from that nasal snuff. That, that, that bumped it up now. Rock and roll, but I'm afraid of the tooth damage on this. I, I, I ain't brushed my teeth since lunch, and it's, it's dark outside. It's like, what time is it? 8.30 in the evening here in Colorado Springs. Dox me, I don't care. <laughs> Show up in my door. Hmm. I invite you in for a bowl, a smoke bowl. We smoke weed in Colorado. <laughs> Alright, but I'm going to sign off. This is Levi Garrett's alright, man. Um, would I buy it again? Probably not. I think I'm going to stick to dip, but I got these other two bags. I'm going to chew through this. Hopefully my teeth don't fall out because it's got so much sugar. I'm definitely going to brush my teeth here, like, soon. But um, I'm going to have these other reviews up, hopefully within a couple days. I got a busy work week, so maybe on the weekend I'll get another, uh, another video up for y'all. But I'm going to upload this, and uh, thanks for watching. Share, subscribe, comment, anything you'd like me to uh, review. Smokeless tobacco. I don't burn anything. I can't smoke cigars in the house. and um, I might be able to do a cigar review um, outside, but... I don't know, man. I, I, the only thing I like to burn is that marijuana, even then it's just that concentrate. But that's like beer here. We do smoke with tobacco on this channel. If I, if I can stick it in my mouth and chew on it and spit, or put it up my nose, or if you can find me another one, maybe put put it in your eyeballs. Maybe we'll put some snuff in the eyeball. No, snuff in the eyeballs at 100 subscribers. The old uh, W. E. Garrett and Sons. 100 subscribers, I will put snuff in my eye, I will dip my finger in, and in good old HD. <laughs> I can't believe I, I'm going to do that, but yeah, I want subs, and I want to I want to put more tobacco in my mouth, so if I get 100 subs, I will put this in my eye and see if I get a buzz. Signing off.